Hey guys, so jumping straight into the video, I already primed my eyes and now I am going in with this soft brown color from the NYX Natural Palette and then taking a tapered brush and working that darker brown into the crease. And after doing that, take the blending brush from the beginning and blend everything together, making sure there's no harsh lines. And now with a darker brown, I'm going to be blending it into my inner and outer corners to give my eye that halo effect and then doing the same thing with a black eyeshadow to give it more depth. And remember, it's always easier to build up your eyeshadow rather than going in with such dark harsh colors because it's going to be harder to blend out. Now going in with NYX's Dare. It's kind of like a greenish emerald color and I'm just taking that right next to the black and kind of over it. Then taking this very shocking greenish, yellowish, whatever you want to call it, eyeshadow and placing it right in the middle of the black. And taking this blending brush, I'm just blending everything up towards my eyebrow. Why can't my brows just look like this all the time? And now just repeat everything we just did on one eye to the other one. taking NYX High Definition Concealer, I will be highlighting under my eyes, my nose, my cupid's bow, my forehead, and my chin. Do you love me? Now I'm gonna bake for two to three minutes, and once that's done, I will knock it off with a brush. And now I'm going to start working on my under eye. I'm going to use the same brown eyeshadows from earlier and slowly making an underwing, I guess, going from the light brown to the dark brown to then the black. And then taking that yellow green eyeshadow and popping it right in the center of my lower lash line. You guys don't understand how bad I wanted to bronze my face when I was filming this video because I had these dramatic black eyes and this pale face. It was driving me crazy. But anyways, taking a bronzer, bronzing up my face, then cutting my cheekbone with that loose powder and let it sit there for a bit and also going in and contouring my nose and putting the loose powder on the sides. And while that was all sitting, I popped on some lashes and mascara and now I'm knocking all the loose powder off. Now, this part was the most time consuming part of the whole look. I'm taking this black body paint and just kind of drawing out the roses on my chest. Very roughly, nothing neat. I'll go back later with a gel eyeliner and clean it up later. 
So I ended up switching and using the NYX Super Skinny Eye Marker because it was just a lot easier. And I went ahead and did two more roses on each side and also two leaves. And now with a black eyeshadow, I'm just filling in the areas where there would normally be a shadow and just giving the rose depth so it doesn't look so flat. So this was the part that I was talking about earlier. I'm going back with NYX's gel eyeliner and going over those lines again, making them darker and more clean. And the last step you want to do for this is put some loose powder over it so it takes away that shine. We're finally at the end of the video. All there is left to do is put on some dark lipstick and the biggest hoop earrings that you own. The bigger, the better. Thank you guys so 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 much for watching. I had a ton of fun filming this video. Hopefully I get to do another one soon and I'll see you guys then.